Hey, it's Megan. Welcome back to another $1 organizational video. This time we are going over 35 ways you can organize your home using Dollar Tree supplies. Organizing can get super pricey, but it doesn't have to be. I also want to mention all the products and ideas shown in this video I currently or have used in my own home so I can tell you they legit work. All that said, we're getting started right now. If you're looking for a simple way to organize your makeup brushes, pens, pencils, art brushes, definitely check out Crafter Square and snatch up one of their pencil brush organizers. These things are great for just a dollar and they also work really well to organize tools. Wire baskets are a staple at Dollar Tree and have been sold for years. This is great for vertical storage. Just add a little hook, put it on your wall, call it a day. I do that in my garage for our garage trash bags. And another idea, I was super stoked when my Dollar Tree finally got the heavy duty magnetic clips back in stock. These really are heavy duty. And of course you can just put them on your fridge to hold receipts or organize coupons, but they are so sturdy, strong enough to hold the wire basket along with some pens, pencils, or throw it on your refrigerator to store extra fast food condiments. These golden baskets come in three styles. So they have the rectangle, they have the round circular kind, and then they have the extra large paper tray. All three are a great deal. I love these because they're metal and they're not coated in plastic, which means they can be easily spray painted to the color of your choice, whatever color your organizational heart desires. I spray painted mine black and then just took a staple gun, attached it to a scrap piece of wood. That's how I organize my craft supplies. But before I did that I hung it on a wall with some hooks so many different ways to use these baskets this organizer case can be found well sometimes I guess it depends on what store you're shopping at sometimes I see them in the crafter square area sometimes I see it with regular organizing items no matter where you find them they're great for off supplies or maybe even nails or screws now do not discount Dollar Tree's sure fresh mini organizers they're great for lunches or if you throw your headphones in one of the little containers, then you can just throw that container in your purse and it won't get lost. As I mentioned in a previous video, if you snatch up some of Dollar Tree's magnetic buttons, hot glue the bottom with some magnets, then you can grab one of Dollar Tree's burner covers. This makes some really nice vertical storage. Now, if you're like me, you've passed up the shower caddy so many times because it's a dollar and you just didn't believe it was gonna hold a lot of weight. Well, I took a chance and this actually works really nice. It comes with four suction cups. It holds a decent amount of weight. I haven't weighed how much, but this has stayed up in my shower for a few months now. In a previous video, in multiple videos actually, I've mentioned how much I love these suction cup hooks. They're the heavy duty style. They come in a two pack. I use them to hang my wreaths outdoor for Christmas, but because they snap and lock into place, you can also use them in the shower and they're not going anywhere. And the last item in the suction cup family is a sponge holder. It does just like the name says, works perfect to hold your sponge in your sink. These food storage canisters at Dollar Tree come in two different sizes. Definitely one of my top five all time favorite organizers from Dollar Tree because you can use them for your flour, for pasta, or if you're like me and a box of cereal doesn't fit in your pantry, you can use them for cereal too. Another great item to keep your eyes open for are these fridge, soda can storage bins anywhere else the same comparable item is at least five to ten dollars like container store or amazon and you can use these to store your canned foods i prefer this personally over a can riser because it maximizes your space one of the coolest newer items new this year to dollar tree are these glass canisters with an air tight lid Another cool feature is these lids are stackable and they stack really nicely. The only downside I can think of is these are not dishwasher safe, but hand washing really doesn't bother me. I use these in the pantry, like when I open up a bag of nuts and you know, that bag doesn't roll down like a bag of chips. I also like to use them in the bathroom for organization. But Dollar Tree also carries a bunch of other glass containers that you can use for food storage. Most of them come with a metal lid. And the cool thing is that metal lid is like interchangeable. So it's not like you have to remember which lid goes to which glass container. Great for food storage and fridge organization are these glass bowls, microwave dishwasher safe with the plastic lid. Love these. 
Book rings are such a great organizational item you can pick up at Dollar Tree. They come in multiple different sizes, and I've shown in past videos how you can easily hang your Roku remote by just looping it through with a book ring, or you can use it to store your ponytail holders or necklaces. But here's another idea for you. I just thought of this one like a few weeks ago. <laughs> I'm actually really excited to share this. If you take one of their expandable phone holders, you can put it inside a cabinet or on a door and then use it to hold necklaces or put the little book ring with your ponytail holders on there and it holds that just fine. Dollar Tree has carried all kinds of over the door hooks for years. I use them outside for gardening or to hang the towels after we play in the water. I use them in my closet door for scarves and belts, but my all time favorite over the door hook is this black hook because I think it looks a lot nicer than just a dollar. In fact, I don't mind putting this on where it can be seen like in a bedroom door or something. If your family meal plans or you have kids with a busy weekly schedule, snatch up one of these dry erase boards. I was super stoked to see these. They come in different styles. They have a typical black and white, red or pink. And to show you what just the basic black and white looks like, here it is laid out. And then to show you the size, there it is in my Diet Dr. Pepper. Side note, these are not contact paper. I thought they were when I first picked them up, but I still think it's a great deal for just a dollar. I love these food tower storage and you probably will too because if you're going on a trip you can throw your q-tip some medication there's three little storage compartments it also works well for crafting and shocker <laughs> it works great for food storage just the same a long time favorite of mine are these storage bags these are reusable they're heavy duty I've had some of them for at least since I was teaching. So like almost 10 years, they come in many different sizes and different amounts, depending on what size you buy. I use these for my pillowcases and my seasonal covers or use them to organize and store your kids toys. Another idea that has saved me so much time and space is instead of buying multiple smaller bins for my Christmas decorations, I just buy one large tote and then I use these bags to micro sort my decorations by room or by tree. And this is really a time saver when it comes to decorating the next year. Check it out, y'all. Everyone's split on how well Dollar Tree's command hooks work. I personally prefer the name brand, but the Dollar Tree brand does have a place in organization that I find super useful and budget friendly. If you're using some of Dollar Tree shelf risers, which are great in theory, but in practice, it's really frustrating because they're sliding all over the shelves, they're moving everywhere, and it just takes a great idea into not really functional. You can use the command hooks to keep those shelf risers in place. You can also use it for under the shelf storage. So like I did that in my pantry just the same. So anytime I grab a bag or a bread, the under the shelf storage stays in place. So I think the Dollar Tree command hooks are a great budget friendly way to hold things in place, but not actually have weight pulled on them on the wall. I also use them to keep lamp cords against the wall, so they work well there too. This is also a newer idea I had that works out really, really well, is I picked up six of these stackable planters. You don't need to hot glue. It's not necessary, but I just want them to really stay in place. And I'm using this for my floral storage, faux floral storage. I make a lot of wreaths. This works out really well. Before this, I did what I think most people do, which is use a shoe organizer and put it over a door. But in practice, this just didn't work out well for me since this is a door I use all the time. It just, the, the flowers were going everywhere. The stackable planters, two thumbs up, works really well. This next part of the video goes out to all my fellow non-Cricut <laughs> owners. If you don't own a Cricut, Dollar Tree sticker section is gonna be our best friend. And I just saw these really cool stickers, pre-labeled napkins, flower, would be great for a pantry. Or if you just wanna customize your own labels, they also sell chalkboard tags where you can write out your own labels. But if you hate your handwriting, no worries, my friend. Dollar Tree also has this covered because you can just snatch up some of their rub-on transfer letters and also personalize your tags. I also wanna mention that Dollar Tree really is the best deal. Even Walmart's comparable stencils and stickers are two to $3 more. For many years now, Dollar Tree has carried cube storage bins. They're not really sturdy, but if you know what you're buying, they really are a great deal. They're great for craft storage or clothing, stuff like that. Just not, 
You just have to understand they're not super sturdy like Ikea or something. I like to pair these up with Dollar Tree's 30 count of little paper labels. I don't care about aesthetics, so this works out great for me. And side note, the cheapest cube shelf organizer I could find that Dollar Tree's cubes fit in perfectly, the ones I'm using in the previous picture are at Target on that link in the description. Now, if you're looking for some really nice snazzy labels to tie on, they have these metal labels, four to a pack, and many other chalkboard labels, six to a pack that tie on. And also, hey, heads up, the chalkboard labels work really great for stocking like name tags too. But you can also hot glue these to some clothespins. Also available at Dollar Tree. Use this for sorting or labeling for yard sales. By the way, Dollar Tree's chalk writer, a-okay for that too. I really like how it works. Save yourself two or three dollars from going to Michael's or Hobby Lobby or something. Year round Dollar Tree sells all kinds of amazing plastic organizing bins. Bonus points, at least in my book, if you can find them in white because it looks super nice and sleek like these nice locker bins. Another great larger organizational item are these tubs. I love these because they're not the hard plastic that cracks. It's more of like a silicone type feel. They work well in the garage or for toys. Right now, as I'm making this video, these are new bins. They're for back to school. These are also that silicone type feel. Really nice size, would work perfect in a pantry, but it can be hard to find matching all the same style and color. So heads up, dish pans. They come in white, really nice big size. You can buy them in the kitchen section year round. Those work great for pantry organization. In fact, I bought 12 of those because I'm organizing my neighbor's pantry. This is what it looks like before. That video will be up sometime soon. Acrylic organizers are always a win for your bathroom or junk drawer organization. But as I mentioned in a previous video, the dip trays are actually bigger and they work the exact same way. The dip trays come in two different sizes. So the larger one, this is just to give you an idea. This is how big it is. I use this for my office drawer and the Smaller one is still bigger than the acrylic organizer, so here it is compared to the organizer on the bottom. But y'all should just really be trying to check out the catering section anyways, because I've mentioned before, so many great finds, like this extra large ice bucket. If you've been watching Dollar Tree videos recently, I'm sure you've heard people mention these, and these are not being overhyped. They really are great. They're acrylic, clear, they have a handle, they have a slim profile, so they're great in a pantry or high up organization and storage because you can still see what's in the bin without having to label or down below, like under a bathroom sink or a kitchen sink to store your extra items. You can see what you have, you're not gonna overbuy, you're not gonna run out. But another item that's clear that you can use for storage and organization is their scalloped container. Use this for razors, toothpaste, possibilities are endless. And of course you can use it for its intended purpose too. Side note, this is also another super big win for Dollar Tree price wise, because Walmart sells almost the exact same items in their catering section, priced two to $4 more. Garden hooks have been a fan favorite for years of Dollar Tree shoppers. And I've seen so many cool hacks on different channels, how they turn these into shelf brackets. But a really simple idea is just take a wooden dowel from Walmart, hang it on the wall, and you can use this in a closet or in your laundry room. But if you want to just do like a one-stop shop, you could pick up one of Dollar Tree's black broom handles and use that just the same. Works out great, exact same way. These universal tool hooks are so underrated and they really are universal. There's so many ways to use them. I use them for my cleaning supplies, but you can also use them in the garage to hold your tools, extension cords, and they even hold heavier items like shovels. The cool thing is too, the metal little bracket parts can be bent upwards and inwards and they actually stay in place really nicely. You can also use these for kids, balls, bats, and gloves. The paper towel holders are not just for organizing paper towels. I love to hang these on the walls. If you slightly bend the metal part upwards, you can use this for wreath form storage. I mentioned I'm a wreath lover. I make a lot of wreaths. I also use these in my garage to hold all the wreaths that I put outdoors for Christmas or use this to hold your Christmas garland. And my all-time favorite 
organizational product from Dollar Tree are their dish racks, and that's just because they're so versatile. There's so many ways you can use them. Use them for shoes, in your bathroom drawer for your hot tools, or you can hang them on the wall with some command hooks over a door to maximize your storage space for wrapping paper, and heads up, Dollar Tree does sell a desk organizer, but it has to go on your desk. And as I mentioned before, I don't like stuff on my desk, on my floors. I'm all about the vertical storage. So if you bend the little metal brackets upwards, you can hang this on your wall and make your own file folder. Even the cheapest file folders are like seven to $15. So this works really well for mail or Tupperware lid storage. If you're still here, you're awesome. You are the real MVP. Thank you so much for sticking around. If you watched my last video, you'll know at the end I explained why my neighbor's pantry organization got delayed. So I'll be doing that in the next few months. I have to reschedule with her. But hey, let me know. What do you want to see next? You want to see a DIY? You want to see some more organization? You want to see a hack video? You let me know. So much love to you, my friend. I'll catch you next time.